Okay, so <laughs> take two. We're just going to do it like this. It's just going to be so much easier. I think it... Okay, yeah. <clears throat> Alright. So, we'll start over again. <clears throat> and, um... Now that you can actually see it... You know, I don't understand the deal with Scum V. I don't know why it's such a poop. So now I have to listen to the baby cry again. But I do have to say, for this... What is this, 1995? It's not... Not bad. <clears throat> We just have to listen to the baby cry again, is all. That was a big gaudy ring she had, too. Oh, don't sneeze. <laughs> don't do it. Sorry. Allergies are killing me. fast. Darn, when are you going to grow up? You pick up those tools from town like I told you? Um, I thought I'd do that tomorrow. No, I need them in the morning. You get into town right now. Yes, sir. Hurry home, Torrin. Don't be late for dinner. Okay, Mom. This isn't what I want in life. I should be a hero. Heroes don't run errands. Right, Boogle? Hey, Boogle. Boogle! Also, never Let's been a fan of Boogle. <clears throat> Ever. Ugh. Even as a kid, I was like, mm. Is this all my life will ever be? Running errands to this little town? I just... I just don't want to live my life without ever having lived my life. Alright. <clears throat> 
<clears throat> no, to one. They never hurt anyone. What happened? I saw it. I saw everything. Who are you? What are you doing here? I was just passing by when all that started. I was so scared I hid behind your barn. Who could have done this? It must have been one powerful sorcerer. Or sorceress. Why? And who around here has such power? No one <laughs> I know. But big old hands. There was such a person. But no. Licentia's been gone for years. Licentia? Who's Licentia? Oh, I don't think it could possibly be her. She was banished to the lands below years ago. The lands below? She must have been evil to be sent there. Yes. And there's no way you could ever find her down there. I know what I'll do. I'll find this What's up, Taylor? Welcome in. To release my parents. <clears throat> How's it going? I'm sure you will. Welcome in. We're playing Torrent's Passage. <clears throat> Losing my voice. Oh, he does not look so good right there. <laughs> All right, so. We're gonna go find our parents. Okay, you can you can go a little bit faster. Let's. No, it's allergies. Um, scrolling, walking speed. Let's. We tone it down. Uh, that looks good. Um. Hit timer? Nah. Ah, no. Sorry. Um. Okay. Just because I can't understand what anybody's saying. <clears throat> I wish I had a pleber for every time I swung this. Pleber, huh? Okay. Um, uh, I need to get that. They are. <clears throat> It's, I'm. Hey, Fugle, let's go. I feel okay. It's just I sound all that, and I'm just it's all right here. Okay. Oh my God, I forgot about this guy. <laughs> I think I have to do this until it. Come here, ain't she? Oh, I got him. Okay. I don't know what he said, but. <laughs> Ow. Yep, the stove's still hot, all right. So, how are you, Taylor? Hopefully, these allergies aren't getting you. I think that's all here. Hey. Okay, maybe. Okay. Oh, oh, whoa, now. Whoa, 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 whoa. <clears throat> Your eyes are under control. Oh, okay, dude, stop, stop, chill. Okay, let me, let me. I made a mistake. <laughs> All right, let's go talk to these guys. <clears throat> Mine really hit last Tuesday. What are you looking at? Last yeah, Tuesday? You got nothing yeah. to do? Staring at snails? Well, I... Uh, no, actually. Wait, hey, I have a lot to do. But who are you? Who are we? Who in the Tenebris are you? Yeah, who are you? I'm Torin. Torin Farman. Farmhand? Yeah, you look like a farmhand. <laughs> farmhand. Good one, Slim. Thanks, Slime. High five! All right! 
Slim and Sly. You guys seem different from the others I've met around here. Hey. You bet we're different. Yeah, what do you think? You're talking to just another couple of snails? Yeah, you're quite a pair. Why, that's Can y'all hear it okay? We are a pair. <laughs> a pair. <laughs> One swim. Thanks, Slime. High five. No dying, yeah, no dying allowed. <clears throat> that goes for you too. What's so funny about being a pair? Cause we are a pair, a figure sliming pair. Yeah, we're going out for the Moat Olympics in the figure sliming event, pairs division. So Try not to. Now. We gotta work out while the light holds. Good luck. Maybe I'll come back here again later. You can bet we won't come looking for you. <laughs> Looking for you. Good one, Slim. Thanks, Slime. High five. All right. Alrighty. Um, I don't remember where anything is. It's been it's been years since I've played this. <clears throat> I don't even remember why I need to get over here. I just remember I do. Okay. I guess to get some slime. Hey, get down, get down there. No. <clears throat> I guess let's just go back up. He's so extra. All right. <clears throat> okay. Well, that was pointless. just to get back. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I do like it when I step on Boogle. Because I don't like Boogle. If you want a square meal, this looks like the root. I'll take it. Oh, that's right. I gotta cut it. <clears throat> I don't remember why. But I just remember I, I know. I need to. That's <laughs> perfectly tight. <laughs> Thank you. I don't even know if you can actually hear it. But it oofed as soon as he did. <laughs> oh god, you're gonna kill me. Uh, you barely heard it. I don't know how I don't know how to make it stand out more. I've... <sighs> the volume is all the way up on um, the sound alerts and just... Oh, shit. Stop it. God damn it. I forget. He doesn't stop walking. <clears throat> Why am I taking a leaf? Okay. <laughs> that was really funny, though. <clears throat> no matter how many times I see Crystal City, it's still impressive. 
present. See, this is just awesome. I mean, okay, think back to like 1995, this was awesome. And I mean, it still kind of is. <clears throat> There's no way I could get across that moat. Maybe this will get someone's attention. Oh, who goes there? Torin of the Farman Valley. The bridge is up! Yes, I see, but I thought perhaps I would be able to convince you to, um, well, <coughs> uh, I guess not. No, oh, we died. He's pretty happy about it, though. The croctopus may well combine the worst characteristics of both animals, but its skin makes an excellent laptop computer case. Oops. Okay. All right, so there's nothing to do here quite yet. <clears throat> um, I guess we gotta go down that one other way. Because we can't get those thingies yet. I don't remember how. I don't think I want to talk to them yet. I don't think they'll tell me anything anyway. So I'll go down here. And this game has one of the most infuriating puzzles I've ever played in my entire life. And... Probably but won't get to it today. We'll get to it to maybe the next time. Maybe tomorrow. It's about like midway through. There's just no way I could break this off. Are you sure? <clears throat> oh, nice blue color, eh, Boogle? Yeah, what's that then? You rang? Huh? Who are you? Where'd you come from? What are you doing there? You trying to sneak by me? Oh, I wasn't asleep, no sir. I heard you come through. Well, I wasn't trying to sneak by you. I'm Torin, and I really need to get to the lands below. Can you help me? The lands below? You one of them? Well, you can't stay up here. You go right back down where you came from. Yep, nobody Rude. from down there gets <clears throat> past me, and you won't neither. Oh, no, you misunderstand. I'm not from the lands below. I want to go there. So, you do know how to get there? Go there? Why, no one goes there. That's no place for any self-respecting citizen. Why, them worlds is filled with nutsos, malcontents, psychos, <laughs> politicians. No, there's no way I'd let you go down there. So, you do know. Oh, please help me, sir. I must get to the lands below. May I come inside? Nope, no way. Nobody gets inside this guardhouse except my replacement. Don't know where he is either. Was supposed to be here ten, maybe twelve years ago. Never been this late before. No, you gotta go. Get out of here and don't come back. Okay. So, interesting thing about this game. Um... In case of emergency, break glass. Oh. What did that mean? I already did that. Um, this was created by Al Lowe, who did the Leisure Suit Larry games. Um, it's me. I'm... <clears throat> I'm your replacement. What? You are? Finally, it's about time. You must be ten years late. <laughs> Where have you been? Uh, heavy traffic. Huh? Well, whatever. Hurry up and get inside here. I am powerful hungry. Uh, okay. Hmm. Can't say I much care for the new uniforms.
Okay. So, get started. Okay. Uh, started what? Don't they teach you young'uns anything at basic anymore? Well, maybe, but, uh, I wasn't exactly at the top of my class, you know? Hmm, I can see that. Don't tradition mean <laughs> nothing no more? What's your generation coming to? Say, where's your provisions? Provisions? Well, I, uh... uh... <laughs> my meal, boy, my meal. You know the core tradition. Before taking over, the replacement guard always cooks the departing guard his final meal. Oh, uh-huh, I knew that. Uh, yeah, that's still taught to all of us. What is it you'd like exactly? You mean you didn't bring it with you? Well, you won't find no home fork comforts out here. It's your problem, not mine. I know what I want. Exactly what do you want for your last meal? Last meal? I ain't dead yet. <coughs> hey, who are you? What are you doing in here? You my replacement? Oh, brother. Why, yes. I am your replacement. You know, there's a tradition <laughs> that the new guard prepares the departing guard's meal. So I'm gonna fix yours. Dang right, I know. And I know what I want. Hope you brought it with you. What'll you have? For my appetizer, I want juice. Berry juice. Freshly squeezed. None of that canned crap either. Berry juice, huh? <clears throat> well, I don't have any berry juice. Let's go get berry juice. Ah. Uh... I guess those are berries way at the other end? Okay, not berries there. These berries? These berries look ripe. Okay. Cool. And I think we go all the way to the end. So I gotta go back over there. Because I think he's got a juicer. <laughs> yeah, so where do you find one of these things? Because it doesn't look like something you find all over the place. Okay, let's skip. Skip, skip, skip. Okay. Um. Let's see what he does when I. Here you are, Herman. I brought you some berries. Great. Now squeeze them. What? Oh. All right, uh, where's the juicer? I told you, over there, on the cabinet. <clears throat> I guess that works. Boogle, can you be an axe? <clears throat> Whew, here you go. Say, uh, what kind of berries are those? I don't know what that was about, Why, but okay. Chuck berries, of course. <laughs> ah, that tastes great. But now I'm getting a little hungry. Oh, brother. You know what I really miss? I'm kind of afraid to hear. Slaghetti and peat balls. Slaghetti and peat balls? Don't you mean spaghetti and meatballs? Ain't never heard of no such thing as that. Say, you sure you're from around here, boy? No, no. Slaghetti and peat balls is exactly what I crave. Oh, okay. I'll fix it for you. What's in it? 
Why, slugs and peat moss. What do you think? Mm, I'll be sure to round up just enough for one meal. Okay. Um. Oh yeah, you can do this. Because this was the early 90s. And you can have holographic... And you can change it so you can look at it because I don't know why all the games had to do this back then. I think you have to actually do that for maybe one or two things, but... Oh, wait, wait. Can I do anything else? Hmm. <clears throat> So I need to find some slugs and peat moss. Well, we know where to find the peat moss. Okay. Okay. Say guys, could you help me with those slugs over there on the next tree? I can't even get close to them. How can I trap them? Trap them? Yeah, you could. If you had bait. And we know just what they like, don't we, Slime? Sure do, Slim, but we can't tell you, Torin Farmhand. Why not? I'm honest, trustworthy, sincere. Oh, it's not that. Nah, it's because you haven't done anything. Even though for we're us. gonna cook them. What could I do for you? So help us turn over a new leaf. <laughs> turn over a new leaf. A good one, Slim. Thanks, Slime. High five. <coughs> Alright. <laughs> While I'm not totally unfamiliar with 12-step programs. <laughs> That's not what I meant by turn over a new leaf. What he meant was, we need a new leaf to practice our pear's figure sliming. Yeah, a big leaf. A really big leaf. You know, something with style. Class. Chlorophyll. Retsin. Something to give us that competitive edge. Something that will put us over the top, slime-wise. Yeah, you got anything like that? Nope, but I know where to find it. But let me take a leaf earlier. <laughs> Alright, I, I wish I could close that out. There's something happening over here. No, don't. I didn't say touch it, I said go through there. This might be the biggest leaf here, but then again, it might not. Oh. Well, obviously, because it's very huge. Oh, nice call. Thanks, Inchy. It's an inchworm. Hey, come back here. Huh. Now, which one is it? <laughs> oh, not again. Gotcha. Oops. Ooh, yuck. Uh, hey, Boogle, get that, will ya? Oh, he's a worm now. Okay. Alright, so we got them a leaf. Oh, that's not what I want. I want you to just stop, stop, stop. Okay, here you go. I found it, boys. This is the biggest leaf in all the woods. You? You did? You brought us a leaf? Yep, and here it is. Now, tell me about those slugs. How can I capture them? 
Texture. Nice structure. Good size. Professional markings. Okay, it's a deal. Yep, <laughs> done deal. You want a I five? Uh, no thanks. No. You're lost. Okay, here you go. Slugs love scum. <laughs> yeah, pond scum is good. Nah, you can have your pond scum. Bog scum, now that's the best. Bog scum? No, definitely moat scum. That's what you want. Ooh, yeah. Moat scum is choice. Too bad you can't get it. What do you mean, can't get it? I know where the moat is. Yeah, you know where, but do you know what's? <laughs> like, what's in that moat? Oh, yeah. Croctopus. And lots of them. Lots of Isn't there a, a movie called Croctopus? Croctopuses don't matter. You'll never get close enough to the water to get scum from the moat. Wait a minute. Didn't you say you were going to the moat Olympics? Yeah, why? Well, if I took you over there, would you help me get some moat scum? Slim, what do you think? Okay by me. Better than crawling. Okay, big boy, let's go moatin'. Here, hop on your leaf. Alrighty. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> um... How do I... Oh, it's back this way. Damn it. I wish it didn't do that animation every time. <clears throat> okay, yeah. Here you go. Here we are, boys. The site of the next Moat Olympics. I hope you win the gold medal. Thanks, Torin. You're okay, for such a dry person. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> and in return, I'll put in a good word for you with some of my croctopus friends. Good word? I don't need good words. I need moat scum, and plenty of it. Oh, you do, do you? And exactly where do you want it? Why, right up here. <laughs> hey, croc! Pass the boy some scum. <laughs> Gross. Look at it. All right. Oh, there it is. Alright, let's go get some worms. Okay. Is it... Well, I guess I'll just leave this delicious moat scum right here for a while. There we go. <laughs> Boogle, can you make a box right over that moat scum? No, don't. Boogle. It, Boog. Now we've got them. No more caffeine for you guys. Thanks. 
Thanks, Boogle. Yay, let's look at them. They look like... They look like slugs. They're kind of cute. Okay, um... And then we need the peat moss. <clears throat> I love the music in this game. I mean, just curious what happens. Whee! Six zero oh, five eight and a three five. Huh. Looks like the Eastern European rabbit is judging again. All right. <clears throat> Just because there's no uh, penalty for dying in this game. <clears throat> now I wonder if I just not he's gonna. Get it. Can you do anything? Oh, hush. I don't remember what to do. <clears throat> nope. 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 Help me. It's always available. There. Um, because I mean, I can't think of anything else. Hint. How could you secure yourself to the rope to keep from falling? It took some of my money. Or my points, rather. I could tie the rope to me. Oh, I think I understand. No, you dummy. How's it going, Becky? <clears throat> oh my god, dude. back up. I mean, I understand the animation was in... in computer games was still fairly new, but every time. <laughs> okay. Let's get back up there. Hey, it's me! And part of me just wants to jump in now, but... Now we jump in. <clears throat> Why would you do that? You'd be better off worrying about getting off that rope than reaching for your bank. I heard your butt.
Oh my god. He's wiggling! Why'd you throw away the rope? Now how am I gonna get my bag? <laughs> Great game. Except for Boogle. Only when it's funny, huh? I only when it's funny you. So yeah, Boogle's an asshole. Died numerous times. What is this? Oh. <clears throat> um died numerous times. Had trouble. He could have done the whole thing. Rude. <clears throat> oh, I skip. Um, what exactly? Sweet Marsh. Oh, sweet young thing. Dang shame. They clamped that. Huh. Wait, what? Um, what if heat marsh? Slugs, what are you, dull? Say, did I ever tell you the story You're so about rude. the last person I sent down? Uh, no, you didn't. I mean, uh, yes, yes, you did. So don't, okay? <laughs> I'm in a bit of a hurry, you see, so... Game does not suck. Sweet young thing, dang shame. They clamped that collar round her neck so tight she couldn't hardly breathe. And then, poof, she was gone. Couldn't ever come back home. Too bad. Huh. Fascinating. Okay. Here's your order, sir. Slugs and peat moss. Just as you requested. But boy, did I have to go through a lot just to bring these to you. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure. You probably just walked around that cliff to the deli. What? You mean... <laughs> Just a little guardhouse humor, boy. Ain't no food within days of this place. Now get over there in that kitchen and rattle them pots and Even though there's a giant city. All right, but this is my first attempt at cooking such a delicacy. I don't like the way Boogle's looking at me. At least it's <laughs> Don't be prepare. mean. Here you are, monsieur. Bon appetit. Now, can we get on with it? Now, the perfect conclusion to a near perfect meal. Dessert and a nice latte. Dessert? Latte? Oh, no. Oh, stop your griping. You can skip the latte. Just bring me some dessert. Huh. All right. What'll you have for dessert? 
Why, there's only one thing that would top spaghetti and peat balls. I'm afraid to ask. Root. Yeah, let's make sure of something. If I prepare you a, a root, then will I be done? Bingo. Bright boy. Yep, good old root would be just fine. Alright, good. Here. Here you go. One large root. Want to help me fix it? No, I'll just wait right here. Somehow, <laughs> I guessed as much. <coughs> hey, nice square shape, too. Them's the best kind. Okay, how about if I make it into a pie? Square root pie. Great. While that's in the oven baking, why don't you and I head back to the Phenocrest chamber? Ah, just smell that aroma. You know, there's nothing like coming home to find the square root pie. Phew. Say, uh, we going out on that joke? No, we're going out through the secret passage. <laughs> Wait here while I get something. Pick a shard. Any shard. <laughs> I've been waiting 15 years to use that line. Obviously the giant one. There you go, boy. The joint's all yours. I'm gonna grab my pie and hit the road. Gotta get on home, you know. <laughs> that is, if I can remember where home is. But wait, what about me? Aren't you supposed to train me in how this thing works? Works? Can't. Don't remember. Heck, it don't matter no way, boy. Nobody's come through here in years. But is this the way to the lands below? Could be. But you don't care. All you gotta do is make sure nobody from down there gets up here. Okie doke. <coughs> that podium must be important to this huge crystal, or it wouldn't be protected by these giants. Ugh. I'm so sorry. That, that came out of... Oh, that podium? Okay. <laughs> I know. Oh, it resets, I guess. Does that? Maybe. Maybe yes, maybe no. This powder must be important, <clears throat> but what if there isn't any of it in the lands below? I'd better find something to hold enough so I can get home again. Oh boy. Boogle. Nah, Boogle would never hold still that long. Uh, to get. Nah. Okay. Uh. I mean, I could take a pillowcase. Oh boy, I have no idea. I hate going all the way back home. See, why can't we go that way or any any other way? Okay, walking speed. Let's go fast as possible. Let's go. <clears throat> Except this is still painfully slow. 
And also, I will say that last bird was not entirely my fault. I couldn't help it. Hey, Boogle! Shut up. <clears throat> I checked everything in here. I searched Mom's sewing basket thoroughly. Okay. Still hot. I gotta look at him going. would be perfect for carrying the Oresti powder. Okay. Alright, that's, uh, what we needed. I don't think you could have looked at that before anyway. I could be wrong. Okay. Alright, let's let's turn the walking speed. Yeah, that looks fine. Alright, get some of this stuff. Cause I don't remember why. I'd better get enough of this powder to last. If it does take me to the lens below, I'll need enough to get home again. Okay, let's now, how do I get through this thing? Do I use it here? And here? Hurry, Boog! Hop in! <clears throat> Hang on, Boogle. I hope I'm right about this. The end. Scarpa. Oh. Maybe we are gonna see the worst puzzle in all gaming history. In there. <clears throat> and they're gone. And the child missing. The child must be found immediately. Oh no, it's not. It's the next one. Oh no, it's this one. I'm not a fan of this world. Well, a piece of this world. Let's go ahead and get this other piece. Give me that. Oh, not again. have to live on city rom from beautiful cliffside escarpa it's the bitter nuts with jack Blackman as mr bitter nuts this and is the worst part of the entire game this is bitter nuts. almost <laughs> with Michael McCulkey as little bobby bitter nuts Today, we join the Bitter Nuts just as they hear a knock on their door. Just a minute. If I have to suffer, you suffer. Can y'all hear this okay? Never mind. Do I have to do everything around here? 
Yo, aren't you the giant economy-sized visitor? <laughs> you know, I'd ask you in, but I'm not sure there's enough air in here. <laughs> Holly, take a look at this guy. This is what a real man looks like. <laughs> okay, it was not bad. Can Holly, you hear it, though? Oh, honey, don't mind him. <laughs> He's just acting his IQ. <laughs> so, uh, you want to come in? Or maybe that should be, can you come in? <laughs> Why, thank you. I will. You can hear all the bad good. Hey, Mom, I... Hey, Mom, I... Whoa! Who's the big guy? We don't know, honey. We're still waiting to find out. Ooh, okay. So, let's say hi. From the lands above. I'm Mrs. Bitternut. And this is what's left of my husband, Mr. Bitternut. <laughs> and that's Bobby, our son. <laughs> so, uh, what's that thing in your purse? Why, that's my little buddy. Every time it, that can laugh happens, my life gets a little worse. people yeah then he won't fit in here <laughs> if he's smart he'll stay off my furniture <laughs> how do you do sir my name is Torin leave him alone he ain't spoke to nobody in years <laughs> yes I can see why <laughs> I don't... okay. I don't... I don't see why. Um... Can I take this? Hey, what are you doing? Put that down! Mrs. Bitternut, I was wondering... Selfish. That's all they are. Lived right across the chasm for years. Do we ever hear from them? I'm sorry, what? Oh, that King Rupert. He really fried my cornbread. Cornbread does sound good. Lives almost next door. Does he ever invite us over? No. <laughs> Why? You think he was better than us or something? <laughs> I'm sure King Rupert means to be nice to you. Uh, perhaps he's just busy. Mmm, busy for 20 years? And that queen of his... Die? Yeah, she should. <laughs> Why? What's wrong with her? Too snooty for me, that's what, Toring. Why, she acts like they didn't have a daughter that was... Hey, have you met their daughter? What about their daughter? Her name's Lena, or something like that. <laughs> you two should get together, Toring. You have so much in common. <laughs> we do? Like what? Oh, uh, your looks, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You two deserve each other. Hmm. <laughs> hey, got anything How else? Describe Lena. Well, uh, let's see. Uh, she has a nice personality. <laughs> She's kind to her parents, I suppose. 
<laughs> She's a good climber. <laughs> She's lots of fun. <laughs> She's a good dancer. <laughs> She's got a great personality. <laughs> In other words, she's a lot like you. <laughs> All right. How would you describe Oh, okay. No, 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 no. She I can't. Okay. How about you, kid? Hello, young man. Did he touch you, boy? <gasps> not really, Mom. What do you mean, not really? You touch that boy again, I'll have you arrested. We don't need no uppity strangers from some other land touching our kids. <laughs> okay. All right. <clears throat> I'm. Can I? Can I take this? Hey. Okay. What? Hit it, Boog. Be sure to join us next time when we hear Bobby better not ask. Just hang out till Mom's gone. <laughs> the Bitter Nuts is not filmed before a live audience. Hi. Are you having fun yet? Hello. You don't know. He's gonna take a second. I'm gonna get another beer. You're having fun. Oh. You're having fun. Shut up. Why are you looking at it? <clears throat> okay, let's go in here. Well, well, what have we here? It's nice to see humility in somebody around here. Good day, sir. Yes, it is, isn't it? But then every day is a good day here in paradise. A land as lovely as this should be called paradise. Maybe it should, but we call it a scar. Becky likes this one. But the real question is, what do we call you? Oh, forgive me. It was scary. Sir. Rude. My name is Torin of the lands above. I am Rupert, <laughs> King of Scarpa. And this is my lovely wife, <laughs> Queen Di. Oh, how do you do, ma'am? Alarmed, I'm sure. Eh? What's that? I said, charmed, I'm sure. Uh, that's nice. Alrighty. King Rupert, Queen Di, I am here seeking Licentia, an evil sorceress who may be in this area. Have you heard of her? No, I haven't heard of any Licentia. He hasn't heard of anything he can remember. What's that, my queen? I said, if you'd heard a thing, you'd have a dismembered. Yes, that's true. She's not here in Escarpa, young man. 
Perhaps she's in some other world below us. But you are welcome to stay here as my guest for as long as you wish. What else can you Thank tell me? You, your Majesty. Do you know how to get to the worlds below Escarpa? It seems I recall a connection back when I was a young boy, but oh, lately we've seen no one at all from the other world. I don't know why. I, I, I suppose we've just lost touch. You can say that again. Eh? I missed that die. I said, I say, that's a sin. Well, yes, I suppose. <coughs> I didn't realize you felt so strongly about foreign affairs. If you only knew. I cannot stay long in Escarpa. I must find Licentia. Yes, I understand. <coughs> but in your travels, if you happen upon a young lady named Lena, would you give her a message? Of course. But how will I know her? What does she look like? Um, well... Lena is, um, very tall. Um, yes, nearly as tall as you. And nearly as unsightly. Excuse me? I said she should call home nightly. Oh. <laughs> is Lena from Escarpa? Of course. She is my daughter. Oh, really? A princess? Has she been gone long? Only a few days, but parents worry nonetheless. I understand. I know what it's like to miss a loved one. Di, my dear, why don't you give this boy a piece of your jewelry? That way Lena will know he represents us. Oh, brother, are you right in his pocket? <laughs> what was that? I said, tell her mother sent her this locket. Oh, yes, good idea. She's got fuzzy face. Here, Torin. Take this one. See? It has a picture of Rupert and me on the inside. I promise to keep it safe until I find her. Okay. Okay. Um Is it back then forth or forth then back? Hmm, I better not. I bet the king has heard enough jokes like I suppose she's your biggest fan. Are we not gonna talk about this one over here in the corner? Your Majesty, <clears throat> this tile seems similar to others I've seen around a scarf. Yes, I suppose it is. It was the most popular style a few years ago. May I have it for my collection? But what for? Oh, nothing, I guess. I just kind of liked it. No, not without a very good reason, young man. Okay. Can I have this turkey? I hope this isn't one of those buffets with a eat-all-you-take policy. Okay, so let's try sticking that up there. Your Majesty, I can see you are a lover of crystals. Yes, that's the only kind he is. What did you say? I said, yes, and how kind he is. Why, well, thank you, dear. But continue, boy. I humbly offer you this gift from the lands above. I think it will balance your set of crystal shards. May I? Yes, of course. There. Yay! <clears throat> and as this one simple shard completes the connection between the formerly distinct spectra above us, so too, therefore, may our two worlds be connected by uh, the, uh, the the peace and uh, understanding that uh, comes from um, you know it like that there. Oh, here, here! Bravo! I say, what the devil was the boy talking about, Di? Beats me. Di, what did you 
you say? I said, beats me. Well, I'll consider it. Why, thank you, Torrin. It's perfect. And in return, I'd like to present you with this invitation to next week's Royal Ball. Nice swap. Shard for free tickets, you cheapskate. What? What did you say, Di? I said, I hope he's still free at this late date. Oh. Yes, boy. Do attend. <laughs> Thank you, Your Majesty. Can I have this now? Your Majesty. I... May I? But... Oh, no. Oh. Okay. I thought because I did something good, he would give it to me, but I guess not. Okay. I gotta go talk to them again. Actually, no, let's let's go all the way down here. Let's go in here real quick. Okay, so we can see the tile all the way down there. I've got it. Hey, you! What a stench! I wonder what's inside there. <clears throat> Can he go in there? It's already light enough in here to see that. Okay. Can he crawl through there? Google, can you be a worm? Check back inside there. I bet it's a way out of this land. <laughs> yeah, I bet it's dark in there. What are we going to do? Vugal, turn into a lantern so we can see what's back there. Wow, Vugal. It looks brown and soft and smells terrible. We've just got to have some of that. Well, let's uh, get it. Say, Vugal, <laughs> would you mind being a shovel? <laughs> I say, be a shovel. All right. Okay, Google, turn back into a worm again and get out of there. But don't forget our sample. Creeper kitty. So what did we get? We got poop. Thank you, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in, Creeper Kitty. We just got poop. Dragon poop. Uh, how's it going? <laughs> Hello, my name is Tor. Hey, get thank you, thank you, thank oh, you, thank you for that raid. So But of course. No! This is our ledge! Why don't you just jump off? Tripe? Oh, just ignore him. He's just a grumpy old stick in the bowels. No, talk to him, Viscera. He must be up to no good. I don't like him. Besides Welcome in, everybody. So, what is Ghost Watchers? Is that kind of like, um, Phasmophobia? <laughs> Will do. <laughs> I 
Ah, gotcha, gotcha. I haven't played that in forever. She'd be quite a catch for someone that looks like I've I've heard that there's other ones coming out there right now. She? Oh. <laughs> you can bonk the ghost. Hey, okay, I wanna I wanna try that one. On the other hand, I would like to get past you so I can steps. Would you mind if I asked you to move from your nest? Thank you. Don't mind, cause I ain't good. Now try, we could go for a little flight. I know my wing is really a stretch. Nope. My wing is fine. Stop moving. Happy right here. Alright. Fine. We'll come up here and launch this piece of turkey. Questionable meat. Hey, vulture! Try and catch this. All right. Well, thank you so much, and thank you so much for the uh, the raid. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's go after it. As always, I'm with you. We're gonna play through this very silly game. For goodness sake, for once in your life, can't you just stop and smell the rotten meat? What's that beside that little tree? Let's we'll see if we can't make it grow. Can we, can we come over here? How close can we get? There we go. I throw poop on it. This should either make that tree grow or kill it completely. <laughs> Ew. I love the music in this game. I know. Y'all could do a, a, a drinking game on how many times I'll say that. <clears throat> Alright. So what, we got five more. Get up there. Where does this take me? Okay, no, I don't want I don't want there yet. Okay. That's a walking. Alright, we're done there. Um Someone left this clothespin just hanging here. Let's go I'm trying not to sneeze. Oh wait, wait, nope. Let's let's go see if we can't get that tile now. Now that we have a purpose for it. Alright. Your Majesty, I think this tile is part of something important. You're right. It's part of my floor. No no no, even more than that. You see, at the base of the opposite cliff, I found an unusual room containing a large formation that would hold this tile perfectly. I feel certain that the formation is something important. Perhaps it even holds access to the lands below. Why then, of course you may take it. Thank you, Your Highness. Yeah, that was easy. Yeah, it's uh, totally important. Alright, and I think... Did I think we're done here. Message. Why, yes. At least one. Eh? I said. Oh. Okay. I will. So yeah, I think that's everything here. So let's say goodbye to this whole picture. It's quite the picture. All right. Um. Let's let's go back to 
the bitter nuts. But thankfully that'll be the last time we go in there. Ever. We're now returning to the bitter nuts, already in progress. Just a minute! <clears throat> Do I have to do everything around here? Okay. How would you describe? Well, oh, shush, 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 shush. Don't, 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 don't. Hush. Shh. Here. Mrs. B, I just came from King Rupert, and he asked me to give you this. What is it? An invitation to the royal ball. I hate this part. <laughs> Yeehaw, Harley! We're going to the ball. Ain't you excited? Oh, he's never been excited in his life. <laughs> Touring, if there's anything we own that you need for your journey, why, just help yourself. It's yours. Oh, thank you. Why, thank oh, shush. You, you love this. I'd love it if you'd take the mister over there. <laughs> hmm. Boy, okay, can we? How do you do, sir? Leave him alone. Okay. He doesn't say anything different. Hey, hey. What are you doing? Put that down. That's my best trivet. Aw, oh, Mom, let him have it. You haven't cooked since I was born. <laughs> <laughs> the kid's right. Go on, take it. <laughs> oh, thank God. All right, let's leave but and never come back. Taking anything else? You hear? And good luck on your quest, young man. Hey, any chance of you taking Junior along with you? None whatsoever, I'm afraid. But uh, thanks for the trivet, Mrs. B. Yay! <clears throat> So, Techie, or anyone else it, in chat, have y'all ever played, um... Be sure to join us next time when we hear Bobby bitter not ask. Just hang out till Mom's gone. <laughs> okay. The bitter nuts is not... Yep, yep, yep. Same. Okay. Oof. Um, have y'all played Half-Life? You have or have it? Because I just asked it, and I know you've got a little bit of a delay, so I'm wondering if you're just being a booty. Not that? No. I have it. Okay. Well, interesting fact. I think I know who this is. I've seen only bits and pieces of of Half-Life, but the guy that voices Torin is voices the G-Man. Oh, I think we can make it, Boog. <clears throat> Which isn't he the bad guy or the creepy guy? I don't know. But uh he's the G-Man. Hang on, Boog. I hope this is worth it. Oh, maybe we're not supposed to be going down this way yet. <laughs> I'm just gonna take everything. This is mine, and this is mine, this is mine. <clears throat> I 
No buts. I need this. I need this as a uh, an emote or something. No buts. Okay, so go back to lurking. Wait, there's naked people. Look, there's all the ladies. She can't get her button there. She keeps popping her butt out. All right. Um. Shush. <clears throat> Google, why don't you go down there as a yo-yo? <laughs> I'm sure they won't bother you. So click oops and try something different. Well, we killed Boogle. This ladder looks a little rickety, but I'm going to try it anyway. <laughs> You've discovered the fast way to get to the lands below. Yay, the end. All right, um... <clears throat> trying to remember what to do. Scared me. What if I tried that inside by that ladder? Um... Okay. Soft pillow, feather fan. Okay. All right, let's go back up. I don't remember <clears throat> what I need. But we also didn't go in here either. It's coming from up ahead. Uh oh, Boog. Skunks ahead. Oh, it's actual skunks. Boog, I've got it. I'll just put this clothespin on my nose. Then I won't be able to smell the skunks. So the skunks are the only thing keeping me out of this cave. Oh, I know what to do. And why do you wish? Oh, well, uh, I was uh, just wondering. Could I pass through your cave? Well, you could try. <laughs> yeah, come on. It's been a while since our last target practice. Yeah, there's a chance, sweetness. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. I want to see the death scene. Okay, no death scene. Okay, so this is what we do. No way out, sorry. He's having a great time. Don't listen to him. Greetings, sir. <laughs> Funny, he looks awake. 
readings, sir. I could have sworn he squirmed just a little then. Greetings, sir. What? Who are you? And why are you here? Even Bannon can't get you out. That's what he is unbannable. I mean, what's your name? Name? Vida. Is this why you come here? To torment me with unimportant questions? Where are the real questions? The ones aching deep inside you. <laughs> Oh, you want to go ahead and get married? What okay. What do you know? Actually, I haven't really gotten to those questions yet. My question is more simple. Simpler? Huh? Whatever. I'm trying to find a sorceress named Licentia. Could you help me? Forget her. I know the girl you should meet. Sweet girl. <laughs> Good to her parents. Clever conversationalist. She has a nice personality. Uh-oh. Change your name and move to Mexico? Nah. See, I'm only here for a short stay. Not in the contract. I to find Licentia. Remember her? <clears throat> I asked you about her a few seconds ago. Never heard of her. Alright. What Do else? Do you know how to get to the lands below? Do you know how to help the area below? What? I don't understand. You'd understand if it was you sitting on this stone tile all day and all night. The parts below, the bottom line, the rear guard. Well, here's a pillow. Here's a thick, soft cushion I think you'll like. Let me feel. Ah, fine materials. Nice padding, soft cover, firm yet breathable. I thank you very much, O oh tall slender one. And in return, why don't you take this instrument of my torture? Just drop it over a cliff someplace if you don't want it, okay? Oh, I would never do that. Well, he's been sitting on it the whole time. I don't think we like want it. Is working. Yes, it is. Much better. Thank you again. Now get out of here. Alrighty. So we just need one more tile. Let's get okay. Alright, let's skip again. Okay, so now we'll take the stinky blanket. Stinky. And then we'll fan it. <clears throat> this ought to drive those women out of there. <clears throat> yes. Alrighty. So now we can get down there. Now that the girls are gone, let's send you down there as a yo-yo, Boogle. Go in there, Boogle. Let's see where that doorway goes. Didn't realize it was all this. <laughs> Alrighty. Hurry, Boog. Hop in. Hop in. No. Hop in. No. Get down here and be another yo-yo. Now that. Oh, 
Vogel, grab that tile hanging there. How can he see? Atta boy, Boog. Can I take that? No. All right, bye. See where that doorway. Okay. So that's how he gets back up. <laughs> gotcha. Well, that's all the tiles. Wee. And I don't remember what you do with the uh, the washer lady. All right, let's go up here. All right, got all the tile pieces now. Wait, do we? No, I'm missing one. Damn it. Hmm. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I have no idea where the other one is. Okay, skip. Skip. It's gotta be the washer lady. Hello! She's so busy washing, she never even noticed me. Hello! She Hmm. Let's do a hint. Warning sign that stands beside the. Oh my God. I didn't know you could actually take that. Damn it. Okay. We'll go get the butt sign. Take it. This is what I need. Alright. Now I remember. No buts. Only been, but <laughs> I've not been a butt. You've been a butt. All right, let's go finish this puzzle and move on to the next world. Maybe. Uh, my grandma and I never figured this one out. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll show the B button. Okay. Yay! Okay, so it makes a face.
Okay, so no. Pretty sure the mouth goes down there. Oops. I'm not... See, it looks fine there. Wait a minute. Okay, that lines up perfectly. figure that out when I was a kid. Oh. The sacred chamber that lies ahead contains an ancient pedo crisp column. For centuries, travelers have journeyed throughout the planet of Strata by means of these columns. Connecting the world within worlds, pedo are able to transmit far more than mere light. Through the use of Aristide powder discovered by Thor the First in the early Unity Pyramid, people now have instant mobility. So step inside enjoy the latest in Pino Crisp travel. Aristy? Is that like a play on LSD powder? Because I feel like it might be. <clears throat> this is an Aolo game, so very possible. We did it! I'm going to Pergola. Home of one of the worst puzzles in all of gaming history. Have you anything to say? <laughs> the child. Is he safe? Far away, where he will come to no harm. Although we suspect your involvement in the murder of our beloved royal couple, we could not find enough evidence to convict you. But since you were clearly guilty of kidnapping the Crown Prince, you are hereby sentenced to spend the rest of your life in the lands below. <laughs> Good job for saving I that kid. Order an ostracizing collar be fabricated for you and placed around your neck. Never 
to be removed. Look at those giant humans. And should you ever attempt to return it's to the land, incredibly above, creepy. The collar will tighten until it chokes you to death. this place wow but it is beautiful i do like this place it's very pretty it's also an asshole Died. After the pergolas tie you securely to the ground, they bring by all their friends to stare at you. You do not harm them, mainly because you're a skeleton. Oh. I had to do something. Stop that! Let me go! Get away! Shoot! Hold still. There. <laughs> On behalf of all Perglings everywhere, I would like to thank you, Giant, for saving the life of Therma. Oh, that's all right. Oh, sorry. seem to be a kinder, gentler giant, not like some giants we know. I what is it with the early 90s and problem. teeny tiny people? Well, of course. You need some logs moved, or rocks realigned, villages trampled. Much worse. We recently captured another giant, but very different from you. This one will not cooperate at all. What can I do? Perhaps if you talk with it. Well, okay, but are you sure I'll be safe? Follow me. I guess this was the, the era of Fern Gully, huh? Alright, let's go find this giant. Oh my. It's okay. I won't hurt you. I love no, that movie. No! It's alright. I'm not going to hurt you. Ha! Huh. You're with them, aren't you? Get away from me! But... But I want to free you. Get away! You'll only hurt me more. <laughs> won't you let me help you? Help me? Like they did? Ha! Huh. Show some respect. Just leave me here to die. Oh, I could never do that. You're far too, too, uh, too beautiful for me to leave you here. Flattery won't help. Go away, so help me. If you do figure out a way to release me, I'll scratch your eyes out. Won't you let help me? Okay. Show All right. Bye, lady. <laughs> Wait. Oh, oh, the. Get over there and show her their stupid locket. Hey, you're Lena, aren't you? I just came from your homeland. Uh, I met your mother and father. You did? Escarpa? My parents? Oh. Oh, I wish I had listened to them. I wouldn't be in this mess. They told me to give you this. 
Oh, look. That is my dear sweet father. And I. Oh, how I miss them. Maybe you are from Strata. But you're so tall. Who are you, anyway? My name is Torin, but I'm not from Escarpa. I'm from the lands above. Torin of the lands above. Do you promise not to harm me? I swear. At present, I can think of nothing worse. All right, then. Quick, cut me loose. Well, um, hmm. Hurry, before they stop you. Yeah, uh, I can't. I I'll have to try to break each little thread, I suppose. Why? Use your knife. Well, that's just it. I didn't bring a knife. Some hero I am. Well, hold still. Here goes. Then, I'll tell you a little secret. All this time, I've had a knife hidden in my boot. But they tied me up before I regained consciousness. Yay, let's cut the pretty lady now, free. Still, I wouldn't want to cut you. Could it get any more 90s? Thank you, Torin. That was horrible. Here. Here's your locket. help you up oh wait look at your arms you're bleeding he's got some beefy arms for a farmhand oh, uh, I'm okay <laughs> I dropped a long ways through the trees before I landed on this soft loam I must have uh, you know caught some branches on the way down it's nothing nonsense come over here I'm sure I heard a stream this way Everyone in Escarpa said we should meet, but I never dared dream we really would. <laughs> Everyone else was so short and hairy. I was always the ugly duckling. Too tall, too thin, hair only on top. But with you, I feel, I don't know, somehow normal. <laughs> I think you're anything but normal. What? I saw where his eyes are. Huh? No, no, what I meant was it you're far above normal. You're gotta love that saxophone. Wonderful. Perfect. Oh, Torin. But my parents must be worried sick. Well, yeah, they are. They really want you to return home. In my Man, that neck. <laughs> you're still in danger. I must must go on. You're, You're right. right. <laughs> <laughs> but will I see you again? Nope. You must. Excuse me, you two. Will you be staying for dinner? If so, I'd better send out several hunting parties. No, we've got to leave immediately. <laughs> we have to begin our search for a phenocrist. Oh, no need. I know right where one is, but it's pretty far away. What? I can't believe it. Does it work? Well, it might. You see, it hasn't been used in some time. Somehow, I could have guessed that. Let's go, Lena. Oh, no. I'm tempted to go ahead and look up a walkthrough for this everyone. one. This is Torin and his friend Lena. Please give him your attention. For everyone's sanity. All yours. But what do I do? Well, that's the problem. No one knows. The Phenocrist hasn't been used in generations. Legend has it that when the Ostiaries find perfect harmony, the world will open unto them. But even when wearing these ancient sacred robes, they cannot find the way themselves. Can you help them? Oh boy. Uh. 
Okay. Just because it, it gets really annoying. Okay, uh, you step into the center. And you, uh, take his place. Excuse me! All right. Is that not it? Shit. Um. Oh. And if you wait too long, they wander around, so you gotta do it quick. Okay. So you gotta get the ladies on this side and the men on this side. But, okay. 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 Oh wait, no, that is right. No, go back. No. Damn it. No. Uh, 
This is a poor, poor puzzle. Or poor. Uh, Welcome in, Raster. Uh, okay. Uh, no. How goes it? Uh, uh, nope. Uh, uh, And you get that one there. Let's swap these two. Uh, 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 nope. Uh, Damn it. <laughs> uh, uh, no. Wait, did I get it? Some bitch. I hate this part. <coughs> Sorry. Uh, uh, yeah, swap those two. Nope. No. Uh, I look so bored. Uh, 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 uh. Well, if I could just plop that <laughs> completely. Uh, 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 uh. Damn it, I need I need to swap these two. Right? Yeah. That one, that one, that one, that one. Uh, nope. Uh, 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 <gasps> okay. Uh, uh, Oh, Christmas. Ah, that's it. The pattern was five descending notes leading to the fourth nested planet. The other door must go mm. back to Escarpa. All right, bye, lady. I'm a, I'm gonna give, just go. Okay.
Wir haben Tanja. Okay. Those back. Mm. This is Torn's passage. This is one of the worst parts of it. Okay. I just need to swap these two. Thank God. <clears throat> It is. Mother son of a bitch. I did it the wrong way. All right, nope, nope, nope. Turn back. Nineteen ninety five. Pretty close, though. And it's a game made by uh, Al Lowe, which you should really know who that is. Everybody knows who that is. Okay, almost. So this one needs to go here. Okay, so. Gotta swap these two. Nope, that's not it. That it was. I do believe I have that one. <gasps> Thank you. <clears throat> oh, I'm sorry, everyone. Oh, Torin, I knew you could do it. You did? Now what? Now you go That's home. I know. Stand over here. I'll throw enough of this powder for both <laughs> of us. Off we'll go. Don't forget me, Torin. Sure. I could, Lena. Be careful. This licentious sounds dangerous. I will. And we never saw from her again. Kisses. Save enough powder for a trip to Escarpa. I'll see you soon, Lena. Somehow. Goodbye, Torin. And goodbye, Boogle. Boogle! Smack! It does have really cool animations and... Oh, let's hear. Uh, really cool animations and really cool uh, music. All these years away from your home, your family, your friends, you must be so bitter. Perhaps <laughs> I've learned to use the dark. This is not free. Uh, I bought this on GOG quite a while ago, and it's been a while since I've played it. Quite a few years. enough to overcome the magic of that color. Not yet, but perhaps soon. And when I do, I promise revenge. But what if you could return sooner? What? Ha! The collar will not be denied. No, this is well worth the money, in my opinion. I love this game. It's <laughs> jiggly. Oh, you know its spell can only be broken by royalty. And no matter how much you scheme, you'll never be king as long as the boy lives. Yes, the thing like that. Oh, nachos. Who sealed? Kurt's well. That <laughs> it's over thirty-two. You know. Wait. Are you suggesting you could become arch authority? Let's just say if you'll do a so much story, you know, I'll, I'll say my piece here in a second. And just what would that small favor be? Nothing much. Just a little magic spell. I'm sorry, but anyone. Who sits like this is automatically evil. That's the evil hands. What? <laughs> I'm getting better at this. Okay, so 
Okay, so my beef with that, yeah, I agree. Because there are games on GOG that are 80s that are still at least $10. $10 from a game in the 80s. No. No, no. That's not how we're gonna play that. What is this? Mm, smells like uh, ammonia. Wet wipes. <clears throat> Right, there those those companies Those companies won't make money, so stop. <laughs> They're closed. They're well out of business. Can you do anything? Yes, it's like where um, it's still illegal to. Welcome to wow, thank you for uh, littering. It's still illegal to um, emulate old games. No, <laughs> those companies have been dead and gone for ever. Oh. Okay. Or if not make it free, pay the company that restored it to make it run on um, current hardware. What the hell is that? Are you bad? Oh. I don't remember this. I would, I would. It's nice to see a military industrial complex with a sense of humor. Yeah, I mean, I think you should be able to emulate old games. I was waiting it for it to do something. Oh, it's it's still gone. Hold on. Oh, I had to do something. I guess I had to catch it. <laughs> You're not. Get it. What if I stand in the way and it hits me? There we go. I love to point and click adventures. Laser beam emitter. Oh. Okay. Pixel Chonk, welcome in. How's it going? Long time no see. What's your favorite one, Pixel Chonk? And, uh, no, I'm not finding another, uh, point and click. I love my point and clicks. I love point and click. That must be where the people lived who defended this island. I've seen that one. I 
My grandma was strictly, um, okay. My grandma was strictly, uh, Sierra. Is that one in there? Google. Google, help me out. That must be where the people Shut up about the people who defended the island. That is one... I've got a couple of Sam and Max games, I think. Okay, get out. Yes, I do like the voice acting in it. I thought that would have launched it. Hmm. Maybe we should look around. Well, good. I'm, I'm glad that that is the only version you can get because I'd be very sad if they would didn't uh okay i guess i do have to go through here um yeah i do want to play it um should i clean it should it will be a box a yo yo i'll be out Just outside the door to the phenocris chamber lies a mysterious slab with a hieroglyphic symbol. Okay. Okay. Who knew? Oh, wow. That Phoenicris chamber must have been... That... Well, can we go there? Oh, wait. Ah. Good old flappies. Mm -hmm. Right open, Boogle. Okay. Oh, it has to be equal. Gotcha. I thought it was a... Um... I've noticed that Steam has been really, um... Trying to get on board. Okay, so we gotta go get another cannonball. Gotcha. Trying to get on board with some of the older games. Um, because obviously there's a uh, market for it. Hmm. How many are there? Oh yeah. My money's gonna gog though. That's where I got this game. Oh. I watched Game Grumps play it, um... I don't know, maybe a month ago? They played it very recently. Sorry. And I had not... I'd seen Sam and Max, but I didn't really know what it was. Seriously? Um... But yeah, I really enjoyed what I watched. It's very funny. <sighs> Interesting. Can I have multiple of these? I'm just gonna get a bunch. <clears throat> Gonna get as many as it'll hold me. Hold, let me hold. <clears throat> I 
about what we're doing or that it wasn't on Steam? <laughs> You're a truther. Oh wow, that's not bad at all. I'm gonna take one more. No, nope, I'm gonna take as many as they'll let me. Oh my, oh, we can skip this. Oh, Jesus Christ, please. Oh. All right, let's, uh, can we up that walking speed? Let's up that walking speed. No. Let's up that walking speed. Maximum. It has some bundle retro set. Ooh. I do like stepping on Boogle. Because I don't like that guy. Finally. Alright. Let's get the hell out of here. Would be handy. Oh. Oh. Hey, Boogle, let's go. Does this seem safe? Or you could have him turn to a shovel and you can smack him. Hmm. I mean, there's a way. You just don't want to do it. He's 12 year old nerd. 1993. Oh. I guess I can do this, huh? There we go. <clears throat> Cannonball come from. Alrighty. I think we're gonna up that uh, walking speed again. Cause this, get old 90s maze. This burn into your eyeballs. So where do we go? I thought it was this way. Ah, over here. That must be the way out of here. Oh, this hurts my eyes. 
Alrighty. Here we go. Bugs Life. I never got to play any of the Disney games. I had nothing to play them on. Can I move around? Nope, I can't. It's strictly point and click. I know they, like, I remember everyone talking crazy about them. I, okay, so I did have an Aladdin game, but it wasn't the one that everybody else got. I loved it, because it was Aladdin. God damn it. This sucks. I remember this game being so much better. There's too much torment. Can I... Okay. I had the Tom and Derry Jerry Doss game. It was bad. It was very bad. I thought that connected. Son of a bitch. Torin, please throw yourself into the lava. I want to get to the bad puzzle. But in comparison, this is, uh, okay, so does this connect? No, it does not. In comparison, that puzzle is cake <laughs> to everything else. Just cake. Puzzle cake. <laughs> I mean... I remember that one being ridiculous. I don't remember this being quite as ridiculous. Does this go nowhere? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. There we go. This way, right? This is burning into my eyeballs. <laughs> yeah, here we go. Can I... Can I go this way? Can I not go that way? <laughs> There's a rock in the way. Okay. So the story to this game is that you are a prince who was who had his parents killed and was saved by his nurse. So But everyone thinks the nurse did the killing, so they banished her and she became bad. And so your farm parents who raised you got taken by the bad guy. So you're trying to get your parents back. Ah, uh, I don't know. It was pretty dark, even for like a 90s, like 1995 game. Um, this way? Yes. Oh, my goodness. That must be. Well, get over there. Oi. <clears throat> but this is a game by Al Lowe, which if you don't know who that is, this looks like a valve. Um, that is the creator of Leisure Suit Larry. Yeah, poke it. Humongous. What did they do? That that sounds familiar. 
something. I gotta be able to do something on here. Cause this is literally all, all there is. I can go back. I'm not going back. Okay, um, I was a little too old for those. I remember hearing about them. Yeah, I, I missed out on those. Hit it, Boogle. Smack it with a shovel. I throw some... I throw this on there? Nope. Uh, you a worm? Light. Nurse. There is a glint in the sand. Somewhere Are you kidding me? You son of a bitch. You absolute son of a bitch. Are you kidding? Can I just jump over there? Can I throw Google over there? Google, go get that shit. Google, go get that shit. Are you... Joking. Mmm. That one puzzle I'm talking about is looking so nice right now. The clue finders. I didn't play the clue. I've never heard of the clue finders. So where was it? Like here? Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah, I know Carmen San Diego. I never played it. We were we we were poor. <laughs> um so my dad got a bunch of like freeware games. I guess from other people at work, I don't know. Um but I tried to play Eagle Eye Mysteries, but I was way too young and didn't understand. Um, I had Gus Goes to Cybertown. That was one of my favorites. Um, 3D, Windows 3D Dinosaur, also top favorite. <laughs> nice, Nancy Drew. Um, I actually have one of the Nancy Drew games that one of my co-workers lent me and then I quit. So I didn't give it back to her. But I have, uh, I have the one famous made by, or made famous by Game Grumps. Can you tell I watch a lot of Game Grumps? Um, it's the mystery of the white wolf or whatever. I haven't played it. And this this PC actually does not have a um, CD drive. I did not order one. It was this way, yeah. And the one that was in my old PC will not fit in this case. Oi. I'm going to be seeing orange for the next couple of days. I saw that. I I have some. I bought, no, it's, I think that's Sherlock I bought. I don't remember. I know, I need to order one. Please, shoot, shoot. Ooh. 
Makes me uncomfortable how he's straddling that. He's enjoying that a little too much. I think we can slow down the uh, walking speed. <sighs> Maybe. I I don't want to go back that way because then I'll probably just be where I was. Hey, you know what? I think I'm gonna. And those tippy taps. Okay, that makes it a little bit more enjoyable. <laughs> oh. Bye. Sorry, Indy. just was uh. the tippy taps make it a little bit more enjoyable what if I go down here? Oh. That looks suggestive. Wonder what this does. Don't touch that. Oh boy. Ooh, good. I was wondering how I was going to get back. <laughs> the jump start. What is the jump start ones? Okay. Am I supposed to be able to go somewhere? Did it break? First grade, fifth grade. Oh, okay. I had Reader Rabbit. I guess that also works. Oh, 
I want, I want to leave. How do I leave this screen? Or is this it? I just have this. Okay. I just saw. Okay. Plan Doom. Aw, learning with Putt Putt. I see. Look. Understanding. <clears throat> okay. I got you. Sometimes it takes me a second, but I get it. Hopefully this will be enough. so rude. You're supposed to be nice to me. Oh. I don't think that was supposed to happen, but it did. Oh, oh. Oh, this is just broken. Oh. No big deal. How tiny I am. Right. Uh oh. I really done did broke it. I really done did broke it. But I'm not supposed to be on this side. I can't get back down. We'll call your customer service number. Well, you know what? Where I last left off the very beginning. Let's cancel that. Yep. So we were in Asthenia. Okay. He's about to reach Telepus. I'm sure there's no way he'll ever find you, but I just thought you'd want to know. You old fool. No complications, you said. <laughs> Simple, you said. <laughs> I should have known. <sighs> All right. I'll just 
take care of it. He won't find me or his parents. Now, what about the rest of our park? In time, my dear, all in due time. I can't believe I broke it. Dreep. I have someone I'd like you to find. Good old nineties. Oh, we're dead. Who doesn't like the the smell of Lysol wipes? Uh, uh, thanks, Boog. Hey, how did you do that? <laughs> hey, Boogle, let's go. I've only got 13 points now. Boo. All right. back up there. <laughs> they only have what one sound clip of him going Ugh. breaking uh -oh. So yeah, if y'all weren't in here earlier. Google, save us. Um, has anyone in chat played Half Life? <laughs> oh, save us! I said save. I know us, you haven't. Anyone else who's joined this chat? All right, you, you'd better come with me. You're under arrest. But, officer, apparently, the guy that voices uh, Torin is uh, the G Man. In a few years. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> now what do I do? All this way just to be arrested. Where's mom and dad? Will I ever find them? Okay, well Boogle is a I hope he's okay. I understood. Is. Is that Is right? That you? No. 
Got it. I wasn't sure. My Google heard me. Google! No! Google. He couldn't just like Come on, wiggle his way out. This time. <clears throat> Do you have anything to say before I pass judgment, young man? Well, no, sir. Not really. It's just that, well, I'm really sorry I landed in your plants. It was an accident. I only landed in that flower bed because I fell out of that air duct that I crawled through to escape from that storeroom that I materialized in from that phenocryst that I used to get here from Asthenia. I didn't... Uh, that is... I... Oh. Phenocryst, you say? <laughs> uh, yes, sir. I haven't heard of one of those being used in years. Where did you say you were from, son? From the lands above, sir. See... See, this evil sorceress put my parents in a magic spell and and kidnapped Ooh. them. And this old guy saw it all, and and he said her name was so Lashia, yeah, that's and she's from G -Man. Down here, and 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 that's where my parents are. So I set out to find her and you know save them. But nobody has ever heard of her, and and well, I don't even know if she's down here or or if this has all been some kind of. And geez, do you think you could help me, sir? Nice tincha, eh? There's. No one on this planet by that name. But whether you're a visitor here or not, you need to learn three lessons about Tenebrous and me. First, plants are very scarce around here, and we are not kind to those who damage them. Second, lawbreakers in my court are handled immediately and forcefully. And third, one more mistake, and I'll toss you right off this planet into the Null Void. Now take him back where you found him. And young man, I don't ever want to see you here again. So no more in trouble. Oh. Alright, I need another beer. Because that volcano level killed me. I don't think I could, uh, go a little more without a beer. Even though it's almost time. I mean... I thought we might be able to even finish this. No, we're not gonna finish this tonight. Yes? Oh, it's you. Could you help me? Help you? <laughs> I doubt it. After what you and your safe-like buddy did to my friends over there? Oh! But I didn't mean to hurt finish you. Finish it. I, I will, if not tomorrow, me. I will I finish it to, to uh, tonight. I'll finish it tomorrow. Well, not all can. Just exceptional plans, you see. <laughs> sure, I thought you looked uh, special. Well, yes, I... Uh, what is it you need, young man? I've searched this entire planet looking for an evil sorceress named Licentia. Have you heard of her? Animal, vegetable, or mineral? Huh? Oh, uh, animal, I suppose. Doesn't matter, I've never heard of her. No, you're not. But that doesn't mean she doesn't live around here. I don't get out much. Roots, you know. <laughs> <coughs> Is there anyone here in Tenebris that could help me? Well, let's see. Hmm. You have to stay awake, it's in your contract. A duck? You're staying What's awake. Uh, where could I find him? No, he's not a real duck. I don't remember his name. Don't know that I ever heard it. But he might be down at the amphitheater. He hangs out there recording talent. Thank you so much. Now, uh, which way is the amphitheater? Oh, you can't get there from here. But this theater, which way is it? 
It's over the slippery slope. You'll never make it. Without a little help, that is. Help? Oh, could you? I'd be eternally grateful. No, you won't. That's just a cliché. But if we could work out a deal... Anything. Just name it. You see my friends down there? Those pesky chameleon silkworms are wreaking havoc on their leaves. <laughs> now who's the cliché? What? Oh. Anyway, if you can stop the silkworms, I'll convince the grass to help you cross the slippery slope. We have to at least get past the slippery slope. So, it's silkworms I seek? Yes, Mr. Short-Term Memory Loss. Clear out those worms, and I'll help you get where you're going. I don't like how you said that. Okay. Hey, come back here. Hey, come back here. Hey, come back. Hey, come back. Hey, come back. Hey, come back. Alright, I, I think I need to find something else. Here's a dead, long-stemmed flower on this dauber plant. Surely no one would mind me pruning this. Okay. This tree's trunk is covered with some very sticky stuff. Ew. speak <laughs> although I don't know why I'm surprised of course I can but what good does it do me no one listens you sound discouraged not so much discouraged but sometimes I do get a little sentimental oh I think all of us do sometimes Yes, but when you're as well rooted as I, somehow old memories just stick to you. I see. Well, uh, not to go out on a limb, but why not branch out into new activities? Well, you know, I can't just leave, bud. I'm oh, stuck boy. here with a trunk load of memories. <laughs> What brings you here, just looking for someone to bark at? I'm searching for my parents. I think they were captured by Licentia, a sorceress I was told came from around here. Could you help me? Have you heard of her? You lost your parents? Oh, oh me too! I was transplanted at birth. Uh, you know, my dad was cut down in his prime of life by a guy chasing a wolf. And mom, she fell in the forest and nobody heard it. <laughs> Excuse me, do you mind if I borrow a little of this sap? <laughs> I like that face. Oh, not at all. Everyone does. I just hope that somehow, someday, someone, somewhere will find some way to make something out of us trees. <laughs> and then they can cut us all down. <laughs> what if someone invents telephone poles? <laughs> Alrighty. I'm gonna leave you be. Gotcha. Can I go anywhere else? No. I did it. The silkworms are no longer a problem. But aren't they kind of funny colored? Oh, those little buggers produce silk of any hue. Just place them on a color, and <laughs> they'll make a copy of it for you. Yeah, and I got it. Silk yet. But don't <clears throat> waste <clears throat> it. And please, <laughs> don't drop them around <clears throat> here, okay? Okie doke. I did it. Okay. Oh. Alright, so let's, uh... 
Is it here? Now that I've rescued your friends, will yep. you help me cross? Have you all heard of this one? So we have to cross. By finding the exact right piece of grass. I love it. God, <laughs> where is it? Oh, don't. That's not where I told you to go. Okay. Listen carefully, but. Okay. You having fun yet? Oh, wait. Oh, found it. Clicked. My finger clicked. Shit. My finger got heavy. Son of a bitch. Okay. Fingers are way off the button. Oh. 
I've ever gotten across this this quickly. I've never gotten across that quickly. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. <gasps> Oops. And you just leave it? No, go back and help that poor flower. Needs me, I'll be in my trailer. Like that, and that. Oh. Still, it's tough enough aiming between the two, two, uh, two of you. Oops. That's it! That's it! I have had it! I quit! Quit? Who said that? I can't take this anymore. You know, th th there's got to be a better gig than this. I'm out of here. Why, you ungrateful. <laughs> you can't quit. You're fired. And I quit. <laughs> uh, I should have never fired his 15 sisters. Oh, the rabbit skulls on the ground. Hi there. A fool I've been. You seem unhappy. He almost killed me. I'm, 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 I'm never going to work for him again. I'm looking for an evil sorceress named Licentia. Have you seen her? <laughs> he nearly killed me. Does she live around here? Not to mention twice yesterday. So is that a no? He was lucky to have somebody like me. You're not really paying attention to me, are you? Somebody with quick reflexes. Should I leave? His body count would even have been higher. Well, nice talking at you. Why, oh, he's a jerk. Can I put you in the hat? Hey, bags, take a look <laughs> at this. Say, nice twigs. Yeah, and look inside. Whoa, whoa, is that real silk? I think so. It feels real to me. Ah, uh, uh, you mind if I try it on? No, not at all. Oh, I love it, I love it. Oh, it's me. Oh, it's definitely me. What do you think? Huh? Oh, oh yes. It's you. It's very you. Oh, 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 look, look, I, I, it's got a secret compartment, too. Ooh. It seems complete. Room enough for a pool. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Pack is my best joke. I'll take it, I'll take it. Let's look at him. Let's look at this guy. Hey, yeah, big old Bailey. All right, um, is there nothing I can do with this? Okay. Nothing here. Nothing with any of that. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah? I'm looking for a sorceress. I ain't her. Okay. I'm sorry to bother you, but do you know Licentia? 
No, you didn't. Huh? <laughs> you didn't send me. The Union of All sent me. No, no, no. Lai sent you. She's a sorceress from around here, I think. I never heard of her. Who are you? Who that new musical saw play everybody's been raving about? Musical saw? You can use a saw to make music? Well, sometimes it make this one here sing a little. Have you seen this saw player? No, the only saw I saw is this saw I saw with. I think we all saw that one coming. All right, I'm gonna walk away from that one. <laughs> Excuse me. Just wait your turn. I'll call you when I'm ready for you. You can warm up anywhere, but just do it quietly. I've got people on stage already. <laughs> Shh. Oh. I'm recording. Oh, I'm sorry. Is this better? No, not really. Uh, let me hit pause here. There. Now, what was it you were saying? I'm Torin, and I'm seeking. No use to whisper now, young man. Oh, well, anyway, I'm Torin, and I'm trying to locate an evil sorceress <coughs> named Licentia. <coughs> Licentia, eh? Oh, sure, I know her. You do? Oh, I've asked darn near everybody on this planet, and you're the only one. I'm probably one of the few who does know her. My hobby is recording <coughs> rare voices, and hers is one of the rarest. Okay. Then you know where I could find her? Oh, you wouldn't want to. When I met her, I found her quite rude. Rude? She's more than rude. She's unscrupulous, ruthless, unconscionable, immoral, unethical, unprincipled. She's... Whoa, calm down. It doesn't matter. You can't get to her anyway. Well, why not? What do you mean, can't get to her? You don't know how far I've come already. Why, I've survived capture in the jungle, vicious vultures, stinking skunks, lava, snails, slugs, you name it. Of course I'll get to her. Very impressive. Mm -hmm. What is that? Accent. You see, young man, Lysentia was expelled from our world many years ago, tossed into the null void she was, and never heard from again. The null void? I've got to go after her. That will be a problem. The void is so dangerous. All the entrances to it were sealed long ago. You said uh, you record voices. Um, have you recorded hers? Why, yes, I have. It's one of my rarest treasures. I'd love to have it. Oh, no. To someone like me, there's nothing more valuable than a rare voice. Oh, really? What if you had a voice rarer than Licentia's? What? Why, I don't think that's possible. Oh, yeah? Do you have any recordings from the lands above? Of course not. The last time those savages visited us, this odd Christ technology was not even developed. I am one of those savages. No. What? You? Is it possible? That accent, it's subtle, but... I thought I detected something unusual in your voice. What do you say? Trade a recording of Licentia for a recording of a voice you may never hear again? Well, uh, a deal. Okay. What do you want me to say? Anything. Uh, let me set up a clean crystal here. <coughs> there. Ready when you are. Test. Test. Is this on? Hello? My name is Torin, from the Farman Valley, near Crystal City, in the lands above. I've traveled through Escarpa, 
on Pergola and Asthenia to get to Tenebris for only one reason. To find the evil sorceress Licentia, force her to free my parents and my friend Boogle, and in the process, teach her a lesson. Yeah. That's enough. It's only a 10 meg crystal. Great. Uh, uh, now, <coughs> let me find the odd crest with her voice. And here, I'll even throw in this old crest corder so you can play it back. What happened to your eyes? Oh. Oh, wait. Thank you, sir. You're welcome, a and good luck finding Licentia. Now, if you'll pardon me, I have work to do. Okay. All right, got some bagpipes. Excuse me, are you a magician? Who? Where? Oh, me. Yes. Actually, I am a magician. Well, no. I'm not just any magician. As of yesterday morning, I'm Zippy the Magnificent. And who are you? I'm Torin of the Lands Above. Well, Torin, would you like to see a trick? Well, actually, I was going to ask you some questions. Splendid. All right, here. Take this deck of cards. <coughs> Cut it anywhere. Memorize the card. Got it? Good. <coughs> now hold the deck tightly between your two hands. Tighter. Don't let go. Remember your card? Yes. Now, if I could make your card appear from my sleeve, in spite of the fact that you're still holding that self-same card in your very own hands, would you be impressed? Yeah, I guess. Well, all I have to do is say the magic words, Ali McGraw, and presto. Here's your card. That's not my card. That's a bouquet of flowers. Oops. Uh, <clears throat> I knew that. Here, watch me make that disappear. All right, now let's see, where was I? Oh, yes. If I could make your card appear from my sleeve in spite of the fact that you're holding hands with that very same card, would you be impressed? Yeah, I guess. And here it is, right here. No, that's not my card either. Well, what did you have? A heart? No, that's not even a card. That's a bird. Oh, so it is. Get out of here! Oh, do I need a better act. Okay, is this your card? No, that's a book. Well, I don't know where your card is. Maybe it's still there in your hands. You know, at this point, I don't really care. All right, then. Give me back my cards. You can keep your lousy two of diamonds. <laughs> hey, that's right. That was my card. Well, it's too late now to sweet talk me. If only I had one good trick. Here you go. You'll never guess what I got for you, Zippy. You're right. Put it down so I can feel it. It's a real top hat with a rabbit inside. You know, like in a real magic trick. Let me see. Yes, but who's this? It's me, Zippy. Ben. Ben's Bunny. You remember me, don't you? Yes. I thought you said you'd never work for me. Well, that was before you offered me this fine silk line top hat to live in. Man, what a hat like this. Even you should be able to do magic. <coughs> hey, are you going to start this relationship off on a sour note? Or step inside and I'll do the tricks. Silly rabbit. Tricks are for magicians. <laughs> Grab your wand and let's practice. Oh, that is a problem. I seem to have lost my magic wand. Oh, no problem. Ask this touring guy here to find it. What did it look like? Oops. Sorry. 
Here, Zippy. Could you use this in your magic act? Let me see it. Hey, what are you trying to pull here? This is no magic wand. I know that. I know what this <laughs> is. This is that hook they used to pull me off the stage. No thanks. Excuse me, are there any sorceresses around? Swabigits with what wing sauce. Did he say something about sauce? Okay, I'm gonna leave them alone. <coughs> Go back around. Here you go, Zippy. I found your wand. Oh, thank you, Torin. Say, this isn't my wand. What are you trying to pull here? Uh, nothing. I I thought you needed a wand. I do. But remember, I'm blind, not stupid. Wow, well, what's the difference? Wand schmad! Are you a magician? Or aren't you? You're right. Thank you, Torin. This will do just fine. So what are you waiting for? Pull a fancy colored silk over me and let's get rolling! Uh, well now, that's another problem. What now? I, uh, don't have a silk. A magician without a silk kerchief? Torin! Yes, Torin. Um. I guess I gotta give the silkworm something to eat. <laughs> no, they need that rod. No. Okay. That you want that? Hmm. A million silkworms. Okay. But I don't have an act. Neither do the rest of these clowns. <coughs> I'm looking for license. Nah, but she might be scheduled later. I got Zippy the Blind Magician coming up soon. Would he do? <coughs> Pardon me, ma'am. Look, I don't care about your problems. I don't care if you got stage fright. I don't care if you need makeup. I'm real busy. I got your name right here on my list. Torrent. Special sauce. I'll summon you when it's time to go on. Special sauce? Hmm, all right, I'm good. Zippy needs a silk kerchief to perform his trick. There's a picture. There is. There's a picture of a silk kerchief somewhere? Oh. <clears throat> oh, 
There we go. I made this beautiful silk as a gift for you, Zippy. Why, thank you. It feels lovely. So smooth. Mm. I just don't know what I'll do with it. Perhaps stuff it in my breast pocket. I don't know. I was thinking you might use it to cover the rabbit inside your top hat. That's good, too. So, what are we waiting for? Show us a trick. Here, Zippy. It's showtime. Pull that fancy silk over me. All right, I will. Thanks to you, Torin. You know, you've been so nice to me. Would you like this book of magic spells? It should get you past any sorcerers you find in these parts. Besides, I don't read that much anymore. Yay! Thanks, Zippy, and good luck with your act. <clears throat> All right. <laughs> This bow could use something to keep it from slipping. No, they need that rosin. No, they don't. They look fine. Let me see if I can't talk to them. Excuse me, are there any sorceresses around? Okay. <laughs> you don't understand. Actually, you don't understand. I'm in charge here. I call you when I want you. You don't speak to me unless you're spoken to. You got it? You got it. Now, get away. <laughs> Look, I know you don't want to be bothered. But you're gonna bother me anyway, right? Why don't you just go off in a corner someplace and practice your saw? I'll call you when I'm good and ready. You mean, you want me to go on stage here? You weren't exactly the pick of the litter, were ya? Yes! You! And your saw! On the stage! Rub! Bow! Back and forth! Gee! All right. <laughs> so maybe now we can do it. Oh, yep, yeah, cuz they're gone. <laughs> Mr. Torin. One minute, Mr. Torin. Mr. Torin, on stage in one minute, Mr. Torin. Alrighty. Oh, here we go. And now, a medley of my favorite songs from the lands above. <laughs> Where the peat moss groans oh. in the light of three full moons, and those <clears throat> crystal mountains summon my heart home. Yes, the lands above are the place I'll always love. No matter through how many that's it, that's it, now come with me. But officer, why, you have tears in your eyes. Are you from the lands above too? No, I'm a musician. Now come with me, you're under arrest. What for? Impersonating a singer. of the lands above, since you violated the probationary period I granted you, I have no choice but to sentence you to immediate ostracization from the world of Tenebrous. 
Into the null void with him. Hey. Not the null void. Exactly where I want to go. <clears throat> there we are, boy. Now you stand over there. Jesus. <laughs> hey. Good riddance, plant crusher. Oh boy. Oh. Okay. There's a big thing in there. But I also want to see what happens when it gets me, because I don't remember. <clears throat> oh. But I want to get got. Oh. What a shame to come all this way. And not be able to get inside. Okay. Alright. So, our crystal broke. Freak. Let's see what it says. Come here. 
I think I have to put it out here. Actually gonna save. The end. Come here. What the? <clears throat> Darth Vader. Oh, I gotta do something. A book at her. What? You dare enter my home and attempt your little magic spells on me? He was like, yeah, that was easy. Foolish boy. <clears throat> I have more power in my little finger than you'll ever possess. your parents were murdered murdered no how could you i thought you had them in a magic spell no torin the farmans are safe but they're not your real parents your real parents were the king and queen of the lands above what but then i'm that's right you're the next king no, that's wrong. <clears throat> I'm the next king. You should have died in your cradle that night, little nephew. After searching for you all these years, you won't escape me now. I killed your parents. And now <laughs> I'll kill you. Why? What are we doing? Oh. Licentia. Licentia, are you okay? That was close. I thought he had you there for a second. Licentia. <laughs> but 
like the lava. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, Torin. That's not lava. That's Dreep's supper dish. I feel like this lady did a lot of voice acting Google. at this time. Of course. Torin, I think it's time for all of us to go back home. To the lands above. So I believe she was in um, Torin, King's Quest too. gonna stay for dinner mom dad oh it's great to be home again oh. <laughs> then that's it <laughs> oh, I didn't know Mark Siebert produced this interesting Um, so yeah, that's just, that's it. The end. Um, so yeah, what'd y'all think? Did y'all have fun? I had nostalgic fun. I forgot how obnoxious this game can be sometimes. But it was fun. And I honestly can't believe I finished it in four hours. Oh, wow. Well. Mark Siebert had a lot to do with this. And Al Lowe had a lot to do with this. Interesting. You know, it's funny, I was thinking, I was like, I don't know if I'm going to have time to finish this before, like, Zelda. Did it in a night. Did it in four hours. I remember this game being so much longer. Oh, there's that romantic 90s music. Oh, I meant to see... You. What animation team? I guess it was their own animation team. Because I know the animation team that worked on CDI Zelda's actually also worked on um, King's Quest animation too. They just got a lot better. <sighs> All the moms, dads, husbands, wives, girlfriends, boyfriends, and significant others without whom this game would have been done much months earlier. Mike Shapiro was torn in boob. Oh, oh, okay. They don't care about the... Oh, that's it. The end. So yep, yeah, that was Torin's Passage, which I think is a super fun game that actually, that, that does still have a lot of flaws, but I had tons of fun and, uh, that was a very nostalgic trip for me. Um, yeah, they, they had plans to do... I can't remember if it was a series of three or just like a sequel and it didn't pan out so that's why it was the very quick abrupt end because there was supposed to be another one and you're supposed to have romance with the, the other lady I don't know it didn't it didn't pan out sadly 
I would have uh, really liked to have seen that though. But I'm going to call it good here. I'm going to go to bed. But thank you all so much for hanging out tonight. I'll be back playing something else tomorrow. So yeah, thanks and enjoy your night everybody. See y'all next time.